Welcome to Little Mountain on Grandpa's Farm. Grandma gave me a call recently saying my grandpa passed away two weeks ago. We had to come back to Little Mountain here to help out on my grandpa's farm. Now he left us with a bunch of different equipment that he couldn't sell off yet because he didn't, he didn't make it in time to sell off anything. Now his plan was to give up on the farm, but since he is sadly gone now, we're going to be taking over this farm and taking over uh, what is left. Now we have two different fields here. We have this field and then we have this big field here already grow with grass as the last thing he done so we're gonna go ahead and make it happen on grandpa's farm welcome back to grandpa's farm As you guys can see i got a lot done i just really didn't do much mowing i did all around the house and a lot of pathways and this that and the next thing i was just working on the old gmc suburban here all running and everything i th pretty much got the battery all charged it's got some fire to it so i just want i'm just been trying to get this started because i want to clean it up and then just go ahead and just try to sell it so i can make a little bit of money i know i got fifty nine thousand dollars but that's because i was helping the neighbors and that uh do a bunch of other things with it being november 4th i don't really have a much a lot of plans i know i gotta sell the cattle make a little bit of money off of that they've been eating pretty good as you guys can see we got you know grass in there and whatnot but yeah our cattle our herd has been eating pretty good so i'm just waiting for animal dealer to come pick them up and just basically just go from there to be honest but i guess let's go ahead and see if this old gmc will run i got basically all these spark plugs are replaced the battery replaced the starter you already have the parts on it replaced so i guess let's go ahead and just jump right in and try to get it fired up Almost. Come on, girl. You got this. Come on. Oh, yeah. Ooh. Still sounds good. Oh, yeah. And I see Grandpa still never got that door fixed. Alrighty, well, the Suburban's running, so now I'm going to go ahead and just move my Ford out of the way. And then go ahead and go ahead and get it. My truck almost did not start. I think I drained almost all the battery out. All right, well, I'm gonna go ahead and get this thing all cleaned up and washed. I got some paint that I can mix up the paint with. So with that being said, I can go ahead and, uh, oh, and she's still, I don't even wanna, oh, I don't even know if I wanna sell this anymore. He moves on his own power. Whatever I'll be making out of this Suburban, it'd be going to grandma anyway, so. Yeah, there's no brakes. Oh, please don't tell me. I just dented the tailgate in that thing. Oh, are you kidding me? I'm gonna go ahead and get this thing washed up and the paint all fixed up and whatnot. Alrighty, and uh, with about five hours into the project, we got it all fixed up, cleaned it up, and she's looking pretty again. So I'm gonna go ahead and just take her for a little bit of a drive. Let's take this old girl for a spin. I haven't drove her in a while. Go ahead and just make a turn here and go down to the gas station. A little bit of gas. Man, I still can't believe how nice this interior is on this Suburban. It's been a couple years since she ran, but hey, she's pretty pretty. She's pretty, so. Jock, they're even still in business around here. Can I help you? Yeah, let me get uh, five fill up with on diesel? pump one. It's gonna go ahead back over to the farm because I guess grandma did call me and say someone was gonna be stopping. That's from the, uh, or yeah, the bank or whatever. I don't know, that kind of scares me a little bit, but I'm gonna go back home and wait for them to show up and just see what is going on all right and it looks like they did come and pick up our, the cows so we made about 4500 bucks out of that now i got 64,000 sitting pretty in the bank still waiting for the uh person from the bank to show up so i'm gonna go ahead and just uh finish up what i'm doing around the farm and then i'm gonna go ahead and just wait for the guy to show up i just got back because i just took this for a drive for a little bit to the neighbors were doing who is this 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 can't be the guy from the bank can it Hey, buddy, uh, where, where, buddy, where you going? Yeah, I just thought you were some random person driving through my yard there. Yeah, I didn't know Grandpa had a, uh, old road going around the farm, but, uh, yeah, anyways, you guys, you wanted to talk to me or Grandma? Uh-huh, uh-huh, that's great. I didn't know that. I've been, been back for about a month and a half, and I'm just now finding this out. Can't you, uh, give us a break? Because Grandpa did recently pass away about a month and a half ago, too, so... Okay. Yeah, that's understandable, sir. Alrighty, you have a good day. Alrighty, well, that was definitely a guy from the bank. News. We lost the farm. So, I guess with that being said, I'm just gonna go ahead and just sell the Suburban and uh, get rid of what I can. I can't get rid of nothing, because he did say Grandpa's... All the equipment, 
belong to the bank besides a couple things so probably not even gonna worry about it probably just let it all go with the farm because it is what it is at this point we me and my grandma didn't know that grandpa had a million dollar debt so yeah that's wonderful i guess i can go ahead and get the uh gooseneck loaded up here i'm gonna go ahead and just pack what i can get grandma ready and just get our clothes ready to go and just go from there actually i changed my mind i'm not gonna take the gooseneck i'm just gonna go ahead and go ahead and get my belt deck and my mower and have grandma follow me in the square body all right well got that all loaded up i'm gonna go ahead and tell grandma to get ready and then we'll just go ahead and find a new home to live because it looks like to me we're just gonna go ahead and get up out of little mountain just move somewhere else for the rest of our lives probably make a new farm let me go ahead and get grandma let her know that we're ready all right grandma you ready let's go ahead and just put everything in the storage we'll put the square body the trailer and my truck and the mower into a storage unit somewhere close around here not a couple miles away from from river bend and then we'll uh, go ahead and just start our new lives in river bend whenever we get there grandma all right just follow me to the storage unit all right well i got grandma following me we're gonna go ahead and get a storage unit a couple miles out of uh the new town that we're gonna go into with the money that we have right now so whenever we get to river bend i'll meet you guys then but i hope you guys enjoyed grandpa's survive a grandpa's farm farming series let me know down in the comment section below if you guys did enjoy i'll catch you guys in river bend Alrighty, well i do want to apologize that this series was a little bit short of grandpa's farm i know i didn't have really a lot of time to record on this series farming simulator 25 just around the corner literally less than a week away real quick guys i know grandpa's farm series was a little bit short but with farming simulator 25 right around the corner i just wanted to wrap this series up on a pretty good of a cliffhanger most definitely be making another grandpa's farm series so until then i'll catch you guys in river bend thank you guys for all, all your love and support make sure you go ahead and get farming simulator 25 first link in the description I go straight from the bank, gassing up the tank, cranking up the radio.